Hello everyone. In today's video, we are going to go ahead and discuss how should you choose between Delhi School of Economics, JNU, ISI and IGIDR. Now, the first thing, and, and I'll give you all the aspects and then it is up to you what all you want to consider while going ahead. See, let's consider the course fees. The course fees for all uh, for pursuing masters in economics from all these four institutes is not a very big concern. If you compare ISI, JNU, DSC, and IGIDR, all of them have very, very minimal fees. Now, ISI, on the other hand, does not have any fee actually. They give you stipend for studying with them. JNU has a fees which is approximately 500 to 1000. DSC has around 10,000 and IGIDR has around 50,000 per annum. So fees should not be a very big concern, course fees. Now, the next thing that you can consider is the placements. All of them have people uh, which are placed in beautiful places across corporate sector and public sector and research. All these institutes have close to 100% placement and offer very good package. However, DSC and ISI have an even better edge over IGIDR and JNU because the packages are increasing per annum. So our professor used to say that the rate of return on DSC and ISI is very, very high. So you get packages even up to 18 lakhs to 20 lakhs per annum. Class size. Now, ISI has approximately a class size of 20 to 25 students, followed by IGIDR, which also has 25 students. DSC has a very big class size, which is um, up to 200, right? So if you think the better the, uh, I mean, the smaller the classroom, class size, the better it is because you get more teacher attention. Then ISI and IGI, they are, have smaller batch sizes followed by GNU and DSC really has a very, very, very big class size. Diversity of courses. Of course, I would like to go ahead and say DSC is the best here. So, you know, we are given so many courses to choose from and it is up to you whether you want to study environmental economics or you want to go ahead and study development economics or you want to study advanced econometrics. So DSC offers a lot of flexibility. So in that case, I would like to go ahead and say that pick up DSC in this case. PhD. For PhD, ISI is over DSC, which is over JNU, and finally IGIDR. Although even DSC has a very good uh, PhD uh, history and people uh, who have graduated from DSC have got uh, themselves doing PhD from amazing uh, institutes and organizations. Yet, I would like to say that, you know, ISI and DSC are tough competitors. Uh, as far as PhD is concerned. Location, all of them are placed in different locations, DSC in Delhi, ISI in Delhi and Kolkata, IGIDR Bombay, JNU Delhi. You choose, uh, you know, according to what you think you want to go ahead and study. You may have any other uh, thing also that you may want to consider. Definitely, you can go ahead and choose. So these are a few of the aspects that I thought would be useful for you in deciding which of the institute you should go ahead and choose for pursuing masters in economics.